Good afternoon, my name is Irina Dragon and I'm going to give you a brief overview of the project impact of using a simulated info button linked to up to date on the speed and accuracy of determining drug drug interactions in a dental school setting, a pilot randomized control trial. Before we proceed, I wanted to acknowledge my mentors, Dr. Stark, Dr. Newman, Dr. Stephenson, and the principal investigator of the project, Dr. Karim Box. We're going to start with a clinical scenario. Patient presents in the dental chair, and while we are recording the medical history, some of the medication we are not familiar with, and we are wondering, are there any drug-drug interactions that we should be aware of? There are three different resources that we can look up that information. In the medical field, there has been already a tool that was proven to answer clinical questions at the point of care in a timely manner with a high level of user satisfaction. That is called info button and uh, is usually linked with different platforms that contain the latest evidence and one of them is up to date. The question that we're asking, asking today is if info button can provide answers to clinical questions at the point of care in a timely manner but this time in the dental setting. We enrolled participants, third-year dental students, and we designed a pilot randomized control trial. We compiled four virtual cases with significant treated medical condition, and we used examination forms to evaluate the drug-drug interactions. The main outcomes were time, examination scores, and perception surveys. This is a brief overview of the study design identifying the two sessions and the 10 days washout period. Here is uh, an example of a medical history for the test group, the info button link to up to date, and you can see that close to the medication is a hyperlink to the web page of up to date, identifying the drug drug interaction for that particular medication. On the left side of the screen, you can see how using the Qualtrics platform, we managed to measure the time and also a sample of the perception survey. In terms of the results, we can see here that for the four different cases, what was the time that was recorded in order to identify the drug-drug interaction. For case one, you can see that for the test group, it took slightly longer than for the control. For the case two, the situation changed and this time the subjects that were using info button were faster. Similar situation happened for uh, the session number two. So basically, once the subjects became familiar with the tool, it took them less time to identify the correct answers. Regarding the examination scores, we can see that there was no significant difference between the two groups, the control and the test. Most of the participants perceived this tool as a good one and they were happy with uh, using it. Regarding the significance of the study, this one represents the first study to assess the impact of an info button like evidence-based clinical decision system on the speed and accuracy of determining drug-drug interaction in a dental school setting. This investigation demonstrates that a simula simulated info button linked to up-to-date can provide answers to questions on drug-drug interactions at the point of care in a time frame comparable to using general internet resources. Future studies, though, might be designed to test and explore info buttons that are functionally connected to evidence-based dentistry resources and integrated directly into a working electronic health record. One of the main limitations of the study was this was a simulated info button, so it was not directly connected with the electronic health record. 